My name is Philip Dibbig. I'm Boatman's Bank Shares Professor of Banking and Finance at Washington University in St. Louis. And uh, today I'm uh, stressed out because uh, I learned this morning that uh, Ben Bernanke, Doug Diamond, and I uh, were awarded the Nobel Prize in Economics. And he put them on like this. So the paper was uh, published when I was 28, and I don't have any other papers that are, that, that are nearly as, as well known, and it's just vanishingly small probability that I would have another paper that's, that's of this level of importance. So if you think about it, uh, my career has been downhill since 83. <laughs> so so I, I, feel, I feel like a child star. Or something. I don't know. <laughs> no, it's, it's good. I, I mean, I, I have no regrets, and I don't feel bitter or unhappy. I mean, I'm just lucky to get one paper that gets this much attention. There'd be some people... Uh, my alarm woke me up this morning. I had the phone on Do Not deserve, Disturb for overnight, and uh, I had uh, hundreds of messages. And I knew that this was the time for oh, Nobel announcements, so I went to the Nobel Prize website, and there was my name. That's how I found out. Uh, I guess a lot of people are awakened in the middle of the night, and I guess I'm lucky I'm out of town, and, and uh, people didn't know where to find me to wake me up in the middle of the night. So it wasn't a complete surprise because I heard people speculating about this before, but I didn't, you know, I didn't really think it was going to happen, uh, or else I might have been up at 5:45 this morning, uh, uh, whenever it was, uh, listening to the uh, internet. Anyway, I'm happy. I'm, I'm a little, um, I'm a little sad that my advisor can't see this. He passed a few years away ago. Uh, away a few years ago, he should have had a Nobel Prize, and he would have loved that. And he also would have loved seeing his student give get the Nobel Prize. 